I think there's a moral imperative to buy it, as opposed to a question of taste. I hope it's number one. I mean, it would be fabulous if this song was number one at Christmas and everybody in the world is singing Feed the World and let them know it's Christmas. <laughs>and any chance of a big concert with all the same people participating? I don't think so. To do a concert um, takes a lot of problems and in fact it isn't all that good because you have to hire security and you have to hire um, concert halls. I think this is the best way of doing it. It hasn't been done before on a single. Um, as it's a little bit of, I suppose, pop history. and. Uh, I think that the idea of a single appeal to everybody rather than a concert and they just decide they come in, fly down and do their bit and leave and um, it's uh, a gesture. So presumably you're hoping for number one for Christmas? I think it will be number one because I don't think it's a matter of taste whether you buy it or not. It doesn't matter whether you like it or not. The point is that it's £1.35 which is an easy way of giving money to something that is patently worthwhile and you get this, as I said, a little bit of history and you get a nice Christmas song with it. And uh, so I think there's a moral imperative to buy it as opposed to a question of taste. And uh, so I hope it's number one. I mean, it would be fabulous if this song was number one at Christmas and everybody in England and everybody in the world is singing Feed the World, let them know it's Christmas. Bob, thank you very much thank indeed. You. Cheers. Stick together here, mate. Yeah, we should. Yeah, we should. Big guy. You going down the floor? Yeah, we're not. We're not sitting on the floor. I've got one row down. You wouldn't say it's all can we have one row standing up on that back box? And we want some people sitting down on the front row. On oh, those boxes, not on the floor, on the boxes. Near the trousers up, please. So, we want a couple of people on each ladder. A couple of people on each ladder. Right, clear the front. Clear the front. Let's move it out so we spread it out sideways a little bit, please. And then catch the flowers. And they're playing the position. We need to move the front. The right made the front. Who's missing? Paul Weller. Thank you.
So make sure you can see the camera. Which one? The one that's hidden back there. The one that we can't see. Right, okay, we're all in. Where's Paul? Where's Paul? Right away back for me, please, fellas. Okay then, so everybody, can you see this, this one camera is all we worry about, right? This camera here. Okay, everybody got it? Here we go then. So, let's have everybody at this one camera now, please. Here we go, at the camera. Eyes to the camera, good. And again, excellent, fresh magazine. John, eyes to the camera. John, eyes to the camera, good. Simon, eyes to the camera. <laughs> Simon. Fresh <laughs> food. And again, Simon. For me to reload him. John. John. And again, we got camera. Okay, we want to do it in colour. Here we go, camera. <laughs> That's great, and again, same again. Same again. <laughs> 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 Edge, camera. Second, and you, we will go for one more shot. now, still. Wonderful. Okay, TV guys, what do you want to do? Right. Guys stay do it. So Can I have the house right. lights on and the other lights, please? Thank you. Okay. 
So I think we should do it. Very, very, very hard. hard. <laughs> 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 I'm beating up a good set <laughs> We will, we'll come back and do that again. Yeah, but we're going to do it. We're going to do it.